After winning all their games in the month of October, Brest had then gone through the month of November without winning a single match. Olivia Dallolio's side welcomed Strasbourg to the west coast of France. Both teams came into week 16 with 18 points, three above the relegation zone, but a win desperately needed to distance themselves from the bottom three. In Strasbourg's last away game, Cherry Loris side had won their first match on their travels against Amiens. And Strasbourg's good away form from that game carried on to this one. Lebo Motiba trying his luck. Larsen on cue to catch that ball quite easily. The South African making a nuisance of himself. It was shortly afterwards, however, that Alexandra Mendy finished a brilliant team move. A really good finish by the French striker. Calmly stroking the ball into the net. Strasbourg tried to respond shortly afterwards. Nuno da Costa denied by Larsener. And after that save, it was all breast in added time. But Tokyo getting a second goal for the home side. A heavy deflection on the way. But Badocchio won't care. No chance for Matt Selsen goal. And Brest up 2-0 at the break. Thierry Loret looked grim and upset at the start of the second half. And things did not improve for his team. A poor clearance. And not enough fighting spirit showed by his team led to the third goal. But Tokyo again, and this time an absolute screamer by the Italian. Loret clutching his head in despair on the sidelines. But what a strike by Batocchio. Absolutely no chance for the goalkeeper. Press then added a fourth. This one of the goals of the season through its teamwork. But Tokyo once again on cue to finish the move. The Italian not a regular starter with Brest. Certainly making a point for himself and scoring points for his team in this match. He was once again involved in Brest's last goal. A penalty after Lienard brought down the Italian up stepped Ferris and Goma with an opportunity to score his first Ligue 1 Conferama goal and the youngster made no mistake from the spot it had been 28 years that a Brest player hadn't scored a hat-trick in a league match the home side climb up into 12th place however it's a day to forget for Strasbourg